Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. I have a very exciting haul to share with you. I was on Facebook Marketplace and saw a post for a craft yard sale about 30 minutes from me. And so I thought I would go today and check it out. And I actually um, knew the person who was selling. She used to work at a craft store and uh, a, was a, is a big crafter. And she was trying to sell through some of the inventory um, from the store since the store has closed. And I think also sell some of her personal craft items. So, Frances, um, if you happen to watch... Thank you so much for posting and for having such great prices. And I'm excited about everything that I got. Um, this is probably going to be three or four videos. Uh, yes, I got that much. Um, this first video is going to be all my non-woodblock stamp purchases. And so let's get started. I got this deep red stamp and it's just a red rubber stamp and I thought this little girl was so cute with her toboggan and her cup of cocoa and she was two dollars I got this uh, ribbon punch and as many of you know I make lots of breast cancer cards so I thought this was perfect I think this was two dollars I got this cottage cuts die for three dollars and it is a window and I thought that was very fun it's actually backwards in the pack so I'm not gonna flip it around but I could see lots of cute ideas with this one I got this cottage cut die for $2, and it is a lace doily. And there's what it looks like. I got this memory box die, and it's the egg with the bunny and the grass. And it was $2. I got this grass border die and it's from dynamics for two dollars for three dollars i got this lamp post and it's from la la land uh crafts and dies and i just thought it would be neat to use for scenes and then i got this dynamics doily die as well it has the two doilies and it was three dollars I also picked up a few other stamps. This one is a penny black, and I thought she was so adorable with her little strawberries on her dress and her flip-flops. She was $3, and then she had tons of Magnolia stamps for only $2 which is a great deal, uh, too good to pass up. I wanted to buy all of them, but I just couldn't do that. Um, so I got a few for myself and some to gift to my friend Gigi. But I got this one here. And this one here. Each of these was $2. The girl with her little shopping bags. I think this one is my favorite, the hula hoop. And the one blowing the little hearts, holding the hearts. The birthday one. The little girl with her overalls holding flowers behind her back. And the little girl holding the present behind her back. So those are the Magnolia stamps that I got. And then all of the papers were 10 cents each. So I'll just flip fast. This is Simple Stories. Happy Day. 
and I got I think all the papers from this collection because you can always do birthday cards and I find it's getting harder and harder to find craft stores that sell great um, paper. You always have to buy them offline and then pay the shipping. So it makes it expensive. I just loved this sheet. This cow is the cutest thing ever. And then the little farm animals up here as well. I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but I couldn't leave that cow behind. And I don't know why I got this other than I just, it's a October afternoon piece. And I just thought I loved the vintage look. Have no clue what I'll do with it. But I thought it was just a neat piece with the blue jean on the back. This is a textured pink with white dots. The, the little apples with the trees and the squirrels. And then another pattern from that collection. This cute piece of Christmas. You've got the Santa. Then the gingers. Very cute. This sheet of stickers. And yes, this was only 10 cents as well. Christmas stickers. Got a sheet of Mickey Mouse. Uh, these bingo cards. Another sheet of stickers. These banners. And it's got a fun honeycomb on the back. A fun chevron. Some more bingo cards. And then uh, the piece of breast cancer cut aparts. So that is all for this first video. And I will be back next with my woodblock stamps that I found. And that will take a few videos. So I hope you'll come back and check that out. Thank you so much, friends.